Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tech. When I try to edit this file document on Word, I'm receiving this notification or this message which is telling you can't make this change because the selection is locked. So I made already a video how to fix this and you can find the link for that on the description below. But actually, unfortunately, this didn't work for everyone. There are many people that were happy with the solution and they managed to fix this kind of error but there are still some users that are having issues with this kind of error. That's why I'm going to have another video and I will show you some other possibilities how to fix this kind of message that is showing you on your Word application. All right, so basically the first thing that you have to make sure is that you have your Office package licensed. So you are not using a trial license or you make sure that your license is not expired. This is really important so you can avoid first those kind of issues. Then the next thing that you have to try is to go over programs and over there you have to check if you have more than one office package installed on your computer. There are possibilities that you have already two different office packages installed on your computer and that's why you're having this kind of errors or problems with your office package. In my case, I have just installed Microsoft 365, but if you have, let's say, Microsoft 365 and Office 2012, so obviously you have to uninstall one of them so you remove those kind of errors that you may have. And if neither of these options doesn't apply for you, then you have to go to the third option, which is to modify or to reinstall your office package. What you do is just you click over here at the three dots and then you click over modify and then you just do a repair of your installation. I'm not going to do this now, but basically you can try those two options, quick repair or online repair. Both of those will help you to fix any kind of problem that you may have with the office package specifically. And then the next option could be just you uninstall the office package and you check it if that will fix the problem. So there are still some more options that I want to show to you. Make sure that this file is not on the protection mode. How we check that? So if we go over file and then you go over info, you will see that in my case, this file is on the protection mode. So basically here it's protected and you click over here and you see what exactly has happened. This file is encrypted with a password. Is this file marked as a final? Because if this file is marked as a final, then practically you cannot change anything without unmarking it. So basically you see here, marked as final, an author has marked this document as final to discourage editing. I'm just going to click edit anyway. So you have the possibility to edit this. Now, the next thing that you have to try, which is the last option, and based on my research, many people have been successful with this method, is to activate here at the drive you have to activate developer mode. How we activate this developer settings? We have to go over file, and then over here, you have to go over options, and then you click over customize drive and here you have to choose developer. If it's unselected, you select it, and then you click over OK. In my case, I have already done that, but just make sure to activate developer mode, and then we press over OK, and then we click over developer, and then we'll see more options. In my case, as you can see, this is restrict editing. We have to unselect this. We have to deactivate this option, so we have the possibility to edit again the file. So we click on restrict editing and here on the right, as you can see, there is a button here which says stop protection. We click here and then it will ask me to enter a password because most probably someone, it could be me or someone else, I don't know, someone has this file on protection mode and I cannot change anything. I'm just going to unprotect this document and then I'm going to try if I can edit. So here it is. Now I can edit this file. If you don't have this restrict editing selected, you just select design mode and then you will have the possibility to edit the file. So unselect restrict editing and select design mode and then you will be able to edit and to remove that kind of message 
for your Microsoft Word. And another thing that you have to do is that if the group option here is enabled and activated, then you have to ungroup. You have to click on this option here and you ungroup the document. So it's important to deactivate this option group, which in my case, actually it's deactivated. So now you have two videos regarding this problem and I have covered, let's say, most of the possibilities to fix this kind of problem. Thanks a lot for watching and hopefully this will solve completely your problem. And please consider subscribing to our channel if you like our content. Wish you all the best. Thank you.